a rather breezy day here in Dover. I'm inside the castle and looking at the church of St. Mary Le Castro. St. Mary's in the castle, which is about a thousand years old, but this is 2,000 years old. A Roman lighthouse, or Pharos, after the uh, island where the original great lighthouse of Alexandria stood, and that will be about 500 years older than this. However, in the 15th century, they added a belfry in conjunction with the church. But the lower bit is Roman, Roman brick, Kentish ragstone, and flint. We'll go inside. This is where they would have lit the fire. Wet wood during the day, so the dark plume of smoke could be seen across the channel. The other lighthouses were in Cali and Boulogne. And during the night, dry wood, which had lit the interior of this 2,000 year old Pharos or lighthouse here in Dover. Tallest Roman structure in the country. We'll have a quick look in the church. Unfortunately, it had a Victorian restoration, so it doesn't look that old inside. Sir George Gilbert Scott did a bit of work, followed a few years later by William Butterfield. There's a lot of World War II history here as well. I'm just going to show you a photograph of Bertram Ramsey, masterminded the Dunkirk evacuation in 1940, Operation Dynamo. So this is a brief look at two of the buildings in Dover Castle.